Welcome back to Paleo Friends. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to get any item you're looking for from Zeke's Black Market Shop in one single Paleo night. So previously, players were able to visit Zeke's Black Market every single Paleo day, specifically at the times of 6 p.m. through 3 a.m. in game time. Now, upon players obviously attending the Black Market, you would load in, and as you would load in, you would see a handful of items presented that players can then buy utilizing their goal. And the items presented for players to buy is 100% random. Now, there is obviously a pool of items that, you know, will spawn in Zeke's shop for players to buy, but every single Paleo night, it can be random on which items are presented and players are able to buy it utilizing their goal. So realistically, if you're just trying to collect every single item in the game, including the exclusive items that are sold via the black market from Zeke's Underground, or maybe you're looking to collect an item to specifically complete your collection or to complete a decorated room. Now, no matter what the case is, you obviously wanted to be visiting the black market every single Paleo night to see exactly what the items are and if it is anything that you need. <laughs> well, my friends, what if I told you there is actually a exploit that you can utilize to your advantage that will allow you to refresh the black market's wares multiple times in one single Paleo night. Additionally, this would allow you to obviously collect any item that you're looking for, but on top of that, save you a ton of time. So if you don't know in the most recent patch for Paleo, they actually did a massive revamp on Zeke's Black Market, aka the Underground. They completely redesigned the entire thing. They've added some arcade machines. They put a bar here in the back where you can buy and talk to Reth, you know, and his goods and his, you know, terrible lettuce soup. And additionally, here you can also see a lot more players. Well, in addition to the full revamp for Zeke's Black Market, they've also added another addition. Check this out. If we head over here to the Black Market, we go ahead and click on the bookshelf, which will phase us in to the underground once we arrive here we can see in our chat box on the bottom left hand side of our game we now have a blue text that says you have joined a new server and now you might be asking okay so what we joined a new server well my friends the Zeke's black market wears the items that they have for sale that is you know on rotation every single paleo night is actually directly linked to a specific server that you phase in so what that means is is that if you simply hop servers well then it will change the items that Zeke provides. Now, some of these items obviously could cross over because they're pulling from the exact same amount of items, but majority of the time, you're going to get a brand new set of items. So to give you guys three different examples, I'm going to visit the shop. I'm going to leave and come back in three different times and show you the items that are presented. The very first items here, as you can see, we're going to walk in. We're going to go down. Here are all of the items. We've got the rugs. We've got the pictures. We've got the tub and everything. Let's run back up, go again out through the bookshelf. Wait a couple seconds for the loading screen, come back in. Here we are, the second attempt, we're gonna come down once again, look at all of the new items here that are presented and the new players. Again, we're gonna go right back up to the top, leave, go ahead and jump right back in. Once we officially get back in here again, look at this, brand new items in all brand new players. And as cool as this is, I'm going to tell you right off the bat, this is not technically something new, right? Because prior to the most recent patch being added into the game, players sometimes could get lucky by closing out of Palea then logging back into the game and, and it'll happen to throw them into a different server than what they were into before. Then once again, they rinse and repeat. They run back to the black market as soon as they load into the black market because it technically is a different server. Different items would be presented, but but this way via the most recent patch is way faster and efficient. I, you can literally probably visit. I haven't timed it, but I would imagine probably 10 times, if not more, just going in and out. Hurry up, going down the, down the little um, ramp, checking out all the items, and then dipping back out and rinse and repeating until you find the items that you want. And it's also worth mentioning here that I'm not exactly sure if this is the way the developers intend players to play, like loading in and out, and it obviously changing their server every single time they load in. I don't even know if they even realize that this is a probability where all the items are completely resetting every single time you do this, and then players can ultimately buy all of the stuff they want from the Zeke's Black Market and one single paleo night i'm not sure i have no clue so if you're watching this video in the future there is a probability that this could be patched but at the current state of the game you can 100 exploit this and utilize it to your advantage but nevertheless guys i just wanted to do a quick video here get this information out there so everybody
somebody that is sourcing out whatever item specifically from the black market, they can take advantage of it right now before potentially it goes away in the future. You guys, as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe here on the channel for everything Paleo related. Also, if you did not know, I do have a twitch.tv forward slash codations where I do go live playing Paleo and other survival type cozy simulation games. And I also have obviously this YouTube channel. If you haven't done so already, drop me a subscribe. I really would appreciate it. It goes a long way to help support the channel. With that being said, though, guys, as always, you have a wonderful day and I will see you on the next one.